I'm Danielle Parker, and you're watching and reading Celebrity Interviews. And this interview is for Jacqueline of Celebrity Interviews. Danielle, tell me about how you started acting. I started acting when I was four years old. I was doing the summer theater camp, and I really loved it when I was done. So I told my mom, and that's how we got started. Tell me about your very first acting job. Well, my very first acting job was um, a UCF student film called To Have Your Cake. What is, what is your favorite part about acting? My favorite part about acting is it doesn't seem like any, any job or work at all, but it actually you're working, but you're have, it's like a playground. You're having fun. What was it like working on an episode of Soap Opera Days of Our Lives in Sydney? It was it was an awesome experience working on Days of Our Lives with Sydney because I got to meet so many people and work with such great actors like Allison Sweeney and James Scott. What was it like to book the reoccurring role of Emma Lavery on the set of All My Children? It was the most awesome, amazing, amazing thing. One of the most amazing things because I got to meet so much people and wow. Do you have a favorite memory from being on the set of All My Children? Well, my favorite memory, well, it's um, the storyline, the evil Emma, because I got so many material from that storyline. What was it like working on in the episode of CSI Miami as Melrose Gramercy? It was a really, really cool experience working on CSI Miami as Melrose Gramercy because I got to do so many things and I got to be a pageant girl. What kind of things did you get to do? Well, I got to be a pageant girl and I stabbed, I stabbed my mother with a, in, in the eye with a crown. But don't worry, it didn't hurt anyone. <laughs> Are you working on any projects right now? Well, I'm still auditioning, but nothing yet. But there is an upcoming thing. Valiant, it's a sci-fi film, which I'm in, and watch out for it. Do you have any events coming up? Well, I have this Breathe Breathe yoga thon coming up, and it's on March 25th, and it's ra it raises awareness and money for lung cancer, and it helps support people young and older. So, Do you have any advice for anyone wanting to, to act as a career? Well, I have advice for them. Just always believe in yourself. Like one of my mottos, I never, I believe in dreaming big. So you too, you can do anything in life as long as you set your heart to it. What is your favorite TV show? My favorite TV show is Serenity because it is super hilarious. If you were stuck in one TV show, which would it be? I'd have to say it would be another soap opera because that was such an amazing experience and I hope I'll be able to do it again. What is your favorite movie? My favorite movie is Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2 because I'm a huge Harry Potter geek. What is your what was the last movie you saw in the movie theater? Well, I saw the last movie I saw in the movie theater was Star Wars, The Phantom Menace, and I'm also a Star Wars geek, so that was like really, really amazing. Who is your favorite Disney princess? My favorite Disney princess is Aurora because she's like, I got to be her in a commercial and it would, she's just an amazing princess. What is one thing you can't live without? My one thing I can't live without is my computer. I mean, I love technology. Do you have any other interests besides acting? Well, I have another interest, soccer, and I play soccer right now. And it just gets you interactive with other kids and everybody, and I met two of, what, two of my best friends from soccer. What is your favorite restaurant? My favorite restaurant is California Pizza Kitchen because I love, love, love pizza, and their pizza is delicious. Do you have any pets? My, I have a pet, Coconut. He's a Bichon Poodle, and he's just like so energetic and fluffy. I love him. If you have had a soundtrack to your life, what song would it be? Well, there would be two songs on it, love, well, three songs, actually. Love Story and Ta Fearless by Taylor Swift and Hit the Lights by Selena Gomez. What charity is closest to your heart? Well, like I said, I love this free-to-breathe lung, 
for lung, can lung cancer charity because it means so much to me to raise awareness for lung cancer. Do you have any quotes or sayings that are always on your mind or something that your mom has said to you that will, you will always remember? Well, of course, I, I have this saying, I believe in dreaming big. But my other saying is what goes around comes around because it really is true. If you do something bad, something bad will happen to you. And if you do something good, something good will happen to you. Thank you.